It is the day the family of murdered basketball standout Lorenzo Wright has been waiting for someone to stand trial in his killing. Thanks for joining us for the News at 5. I'm Stephanie Skurlock. I'm Greg Hurst. Billy Ray Turner is the one person still left to answer for that killing. His trial kicked off today with jury selection. Our WRG's April Thompson is live at 201 Poplar tonight where that jury selection just wrapped up. What can you tell us about the jury, April? That jury selection, like you said, Stephanie, just ending. It's been a long process all day, but they have selected 15 jurors Five of them, um, seven of them are white, eight of them are black, eight females, and seven males. So they have been selected. Those are the individuals that, that are going to try this case. They will meet again here at 10 o'clock in the morning. It's been a long process because they had 80 jurors to go through to make that selection from, and they had to um, question all of those jurors. But now, after they have been seated, Billy Ray Turner will get his day in court. The jurors who will decide Billy Turner's fate are being questioned on how much they know about the murder case. The judge already instructing them they won't be going home anytime soon and not to watch any media about the case. The prosecuting attorney hinting early this will be a long process. I'm confident we can get a jury that's fair and impartial. Uh, it'll take some work today and hopefully we'll have them today, maybe tomorrow, and we'll get this trial started. Uh, they're going to make sacrifices because they're going to be sequestered at least for at least for a week. Uh, it's going to be a hard trial, and these jurors are going to be asked to uh, make some real sacrifices and and do this thing. Turner is the only person to stand trial in the murder of Lorenzen Wright back in 2010. Wright's ex-wife Shara took a plea before she ever went to trial, admitting she facilitated the murder. She got 30 years. She is said to have solicited Turner, her church member, to do the crime. But the attorney for Turner plans to prove he is innocent. The prosecution is tight-lipped on whether Shero will testify. But they admit her cousin, Jimmy Martin, who led police to the gun that killed Lorenzen Wright, and then to Billy Ray Turner, will be in court. Are we going to hear anything from Jimmy Martin in a statement or anything like that? I would expect to. Will he be in court? I would expect he would be. And there you heard it, Jimmy Martin expected to be in court, to, um, to, well, maybe not tomorrow, but throughout this trial, we expect to hear from him. And he is a big part of this trial because he was the key as far as finding the gun and also linking Billy Ray Turner to this case. But Jimmy Martin is also in jail. He has been convicted of killing his girlfriend. So you can expect that um, Billy, Mar Billy Ray Turner's um, attorney will bring that up, that he can't be trusted about what he has to say and pointing the finger at Billy Ray Turner. As far as other people, we expect to testify family and church members of Billy Ray Turner. As far as Lorenzo Wright's family, they are expected to be here tomorrow when the trial starts. And look at this, something you don't often see. This is what everybody will have to go through tomorrow to get into the courtroom. A metal detector. You don't see that often in a lot of these cases. But around here, they're not taking any chances. I'm News Channel 3's April Thompson reporting live in downtown Memphis.